Hey Magical Babes, Adelina here and welcome to my first squash painting ever! I'm really excited to not only show you this time lapse but also tell you Magical Babes my review of my first squash painting. I got this set of 5 canvases from Hobby Lobby for $10 so I added a border of pink Valentine's washi tape and sketched out my idea all around the canvas knowing that eventually the gouache would cover it up throughout time. I got this 24 set of gouache paint from Hobby Lobby which was $13.99 and it is the Hobby Lobby brand. I also ended up purchasing this 4 set of mason jars with this cute heart design on it. Honestly, I thought these mason jars would be cute to travel along and paint with my gouache paint anywhere I go. Just in case you magic babes didn't know what gouache is, I'm going to read you the definition off of Google. It's a method- uh, I'm sorry. It's a method of painting using opaque pigments ground in water and thickened in a glue-like substance. Opaque watercolor of the type used in gouache painting. And to be honest, it's basically like watercolor and acrylics baby creating gouache. I know it's a different type of example, but that's honestly what I thought of it as. I wanted to try gouache in order to improve my art skills and eventually get better with different art styles and mediums. I just thought it was very interesting and I've seen a lot of YouTubers try it themselves. So I thought it'd be cool and interesting to see if I was up to the challenge myself. My goals with gouache are honestly just to get better with my painting skills and just trying to be fearless and painting on canvases because painting on a canvas is something entirely new to me but I did find it fun though I was worried throughout the entire time that I was gonna poke a big hole throughout it but I did have fun creating this piece and it did mean a lot to me. I did have moments where I did love the gouache and thought it was very beautiful to see and watch it become matte and grow and spread very easily and the way it lasted very long with only one or two strokes here and there every now and again. I am a student of gouache and this painting description on the back did say it was for students of gouache and honestly I thought it was perfect to watch and see the way that the paints reacted to each other and reactivated when touched dry or near tremendous amounts of water. Scientists say the world and the universe as we know it was created by the Big Bang. And in my heart, in my comic, in my world, I could picture a giant, massive, dark, ominous orb sitting in a dark abyss, surrounded by nothing but darkness, with no light surrounding or near it, to one day the life and light and love and magic within grows so strong it bursts out of the dark ominous orb, creating the worlds and the universe and galaxies and planets and beautiful stars that fill the universe as we know it. And honestly, that's what I pictured in my head when I created this canvas. And though it may not be what some people believe have happened, but in my mind, in my world, in my heart, in my comic, this is how my worlds are created. And this piece just means a lot to me because it's personally a part of me and my OCs in my world. And hopefully I can one day share the backstory and more of my comic to you wonderful magical babes. My goal at the moment is to write as many chapters of my comic as possible to eventually end up drawing and coming up with a comic book layout to lead up to releasing my comic on who knows, maybe webtoon or I haven't really decided yet. But for now that is my short term goal is to continue writing all the chapters to eventually draw out every single comic layout to release to you magical babes and share my wonderful magical world with all of you.
I want to thank you Magical Babes for sticking around for my first time painting with gouache video. I really did have a lot of fun sharing and talking with you Magical Babes. It always is the best whenever I have a new experience, a new challenge, and I'm able to experience it with you babes. I want you all to follow your hearts and if you have a challenge yourself, be fearless, be brave, you can do this. Don't give up. Follow your dreams and you will succeed. I love this canvas of just in all and I will eventually get better at being an artist, a writer, and a creator. And I hope you stay tuned with that. Ah, stay tuned for that by subscribing. And until next time, Magical Babes, I really hope you have an enchanting day. Goodbye, and I'll see you on my next magical adventure. Mm-hmm. <laughs>